Hello, my name is Matt, and I'm here to talk about selling remanufactured engines. The market for remanufactured engines continues to grow because people are keeping their vehicles longer and driving more miles than ever before. Even so, an engine is a big investment, and you can bet your customer is going to shop around for the best deal. Why would anyone buy a remanufactured engine? If you think about it, when a vehicle's engine needs to be replaced, the owner has three options. First, they can replace their car, but that means paying the license, tax, registration fees, and almost always significantly higher insurance costs and monthly payments. Second, they could buy a recycled engine to replace the one they have. This is usually the least expensive way to get the part and makes a lot of sense if they're not going to keep the vehicle very long after the repair. Or third, they could buy a remanufactured engine from you and plan on years of trouble-free performance. What would you do? In this short video, we'll discuss some things that not only will help you close an engine sale, but keep your customer delighted with their decision to buy from you. At the end, I hope you'll know how to answer the most common questions customers have on this type of product. First, your customer needs a very specific engine to replace the one in their car or truck. So always verify the customer's exact application. The vehicle VIN number is the best way to confirm the make, model, year, and engine size you are looking for. Don't rely on the customer to tell you what they think they have. Get their VIN and make sure. Next, look up their vehicle in your system. You may see a couple different engines listed that fit your customer's vehicle. Your VIN check has already determined the engine leader size, so any other sizes can be ignored. Sometimes there are still multiple choices, all for your leader size and VIN letter. These will all work for your customer, but have different price points based on the dress level of the engine. Most engines we make are long block assemblies as shown here, but some engines come more complete as they may have oil pans, timing covers, or in some cases, even valve covers. Look at our part number description carefully and give your customer the options if multiple dress levels are available. Once you have the correct part number for your customer, tell them about the warranty coverage that comes with it. Remember, the customer is buying a part and a warranty from you. You'll close a lot more sales if you tell them about this part of their purchase. You can start the conversation with this question. Is the engine you are looking for going to be professionally installed? Obviously, if you're quoting a shop, you can skip this question. Why is that a good starting point? Because if your customer is not having the engine professionally installed, they don't qualify for warranty labor if they have a problem down the road. If the installation is done at an automotive repair shop, most all of our light duty gasoline engines are covered for three years with no mileage limit. This standard warranty covers parts and labor should the engine they purchase be later determined to have a defect. What are some other things your customers should know about their engine warranty? It's fully transferable without a fee or a registration requirement. It's good nationwide and does not need to go back to your installer for warranty service. It doesn't require any upfront registration to be in effect. It doesn't require service records to keep your warranty valid. All those things have value to your customer, but they won't know any of that unless you tell them. Okay, a couple things to remember about warranty. First, what is that warranty difference in do-it-yourself installs again? DIY customers have warranty coverage on part defects, but no labor coverage. Remember it this way, if they are not paying a professional shop to do the installation, then they are forfeiting their right to labor reimbursement in the event of a claim. Second, if your customer's engine is replaced under warranty, it doesn't start over with a new warranty. It has coverage for whatever remains in the original warranty term. Third, we do not allow any warranty on motorhomes. Fourth, vehicles in excess of 11,000 pounds of gross vehicle weight will carry a 12-month or 12,000-mile warranty. Fifth, diesel engines also carry a 12-month or 12,000-mile warranty. And finally, marine engines are available and are designed exclusively for marine use. These engines carry an 18-month unlimited hour warranty. So now you know how to answer the most common questions about warranty and some warranty features that can help you close the sale. Next, let's talk about core. Your customer needs to know that you are going to charge them for a core, but will have a guaranteed refund if they bring the old engine back assembled and in the same package it was shipped in. This is important. With our gas engines, you can be sure that you will get 100% core credit, even if you return to damaged core. Most other companies will nickel and dime people on core damage. Most engines are shipped in a closed plastic tub, protecting the engine when shipped and the core when it's returned. It's also important to ask your customer to drain all fluids before returning their core and to return it when their engine swap is finished. They may need that one more part of their core that is really hard to get once it's been returned. Our next topic is shipping. An engine is not insignificant in either size or weight and you need to know what to expect as these move about the country. The engine you just sold might come out of your DC or warehouse and arrive at your store with the rest of your warehouse order. Otherwise, your customer's engine will be shipped on a truck line from one of our warehouses. If we are delivering to your store, shop, or residential address, we will always need to know if you require a lift gate upon delivery. Don't put your customer in a situation that requires lifting an engine off the back of a truck. 
If you're requesting a delivery to a residential address, most freight carriers require an appointment established by the recipient and the trucking company. So what comes with our engines? Our long block assemblies come complete with a gasket set and oil pump. Dress long blocks have the oil pump already installed along with most of the gaskets that will be required. Well, that covers the basics and should help you answer the most common questions you'll get about remanufactured engines. Now, what does your boss want you to remember? Selling an engine is a great opportunity to get some add-on sales. If you think about it, the customer is going to need plugs, belts, hoses, oil, and antifreeze. Perhaps motor mounts, water pump, or a thermostat. Get all the extras that come with an engine sale. Ask your customer if they know what caused their original engine to fail. Chances are good that a worn-out component or part caused or contributed. Boost your ticket and be assured the install gets done with the best parts available. So, let's review. How do you sell an engine? Get the info needed to select the right part. Tell the customer about the three-year, fully transferable nationwide warranty. Tell the customer about the core deposit and refund guarantee regardless of damage. Get the critical information about shipping. Add on additional parts needed for a good install. Thanks for watching and let's sell some engines.